Hey guys, welcome to an all new episode of Conflix. Today I'm excited to show you something a little bit different. Now, we have smart TVs, smartphones, even smart refrigerators. But this here is a smart rear view mirror for your car. How cool is that? Not only does it have a built in camera, which you can actually see while you're driving, but you can play videos, even pictures, even music as well. So it's actually a really cool concept, which I'm really excited to see. Now, this was sent over by Momentum US. So if you want your very own, check out their Amazon store link down below. So without further ado, let's go ahead and unbox this thing and see what it's all about. Alright, so this here's our box, a uh, very simple design, and just goes ahead and opens up just like that. And right away on the top here, you do see the mirror. Wow, look at that. So you do see that there's a screen here on the left hand side, and then you have buttons on the bo bottom here, you got the power button, a toggle, uh, and then even over here you do see the camera itself kind of perking out. Now no, you can actually control it using the mirror itself, so it actually even rotate for a full 360 degrees, so you can actually see it at every angle. Now the unique thing about this is what else it comes with. So one thing we have is a sensor, so for instance if someone hits the car on the side, it will automatically record it, in which it actually saves it to a, a small SD card that goes into the uh, mirror itself. And over here we have ourselves the adapter, so this goes into the cigarette lighters, which charges the actual uh, mirror itself. And then this plugs into the sensor, which plugs into the mirror. So it doesn't go outside the car at all, and everything is just literally a plug and play feature, which is really nice and very simple. Now, the way it hooks up is actually a very interesting way. So you have these little clips here, uh, literally goes over the old mirror, and then you just go ahead and fasten it in. Uh, it's even got a carbon fiber appearance over here, so it actually has a very nice sporty edge look to it as well. And then you have a built in speaker here as well. So this here is going to be a cleaning cloth as well as a quick little start guide, uh, kind of laying out exactly how to go ahead and install it in terms of features go. So you can just go ahead and hook it up and just play. So with that being said, let's go ahead and try this out and see what it's all about. Alright, so we're all set and ready to go. I had it hardwired into the actual uh, adapter itself over here. Now I have the car on and literally uh, you can actually program it to turn on by itself but I put it on here so you can just press the power button and check that out. <laughs> That is so cool! So it does record and it does record it onto the card itself. So in case if you ever get into an accident, it's actually a really good thing to have. Uh, just because you know you never know what might happen. Anyways, let's go ahead and just click on the uh, menu button here. And then uh, we just click that. There you go. So you can see all the different things here. So we have a video mode. So you can actually play back stuff. Uh, you can watch photos. Uh, the playback, uh, locking of a video, audio. Uh, and then there's a menu. So in terms of the menu goes, you have a lot of different uh, things such as the G sensor. Now here's our sensor itself. Uh, so that detects uh, if there's ever a hit or something like that if someone touches the car. The camera will automatically start recording. So you know just, just be aware of that. Uh, now another feature that we can do is uh, you can actually change the speed like the, the uh, on screen itself. So as soon as it boots up you can load a picture of your own car. So you know just something cool to do. And it's got vibration, different sounds, uh, you can change the language, the clock, so on and so forth. It's fully customizable and you can always update it as well. Okay, and then if I just go ahead and stop it, just like that, there we go. And if I go to the menu, I can hit playback, and then I can watch the video that I just recorded. Hey. That's some cool stuff. So you can do a lot of different things with it, uh, and it's always good to have. And you can just delete it. You can take it out and you know store it the way you want to, uh, and then just use it for different things. So definitely a very cool feature. Uh, and you can actually like you know create a slideshow and show your friends. <laughs> but you know just some different things that you can do with it. And again, you know fully customizable. And yeah, so there you guys have it. You know kind of gives you an idea of how it all works out. You know, you can also press uh, the uh, rotational mode, so for instance, if I let, let it keep going, it'll start turning on its own, just like that. And I'll record me, and I'll go back as well. So that's like a surveillance mode that it has. So you can actually just do a lot of different things with it, and get it in the right angle that you want. So definitely a very cool feature. Uh, but yeah, there you guys have it. Now if you guys had any questions about this particular smart mirror, feel free to comment down below. Otherwise, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Take care now. Bye-bye.